Up next, what star allowed the super nanny into her home to get her parenting skills? Stop. You, famous, hey, went on stop. national TV yeah. to say, I'm not a perfect mama. most remarkable moms. Now, you know my next guest is one of the famous daughters of Brian Wilson from the Beach Boys, but she's quite the remarkable mama herself. And while most celebrities refuse to admit that their kids have behavioral problems, she went on national TV to see if she could get some help. I'm talking about Wendy Wilson of Wilson Phillips. Wendy Wilson, the sexy singer is the daughter of legendary Beach Boy, Brian Wilson. Wendy, along with sister Carney and friend China Phillips, formed the wildly successful singing sensation of the 90s, Wilson Phillips. These days, Wendy has a new group, her husband and four sons, but their household is not always harmonious. I don't have the respect that I should have for my children. Leo! Wendy recently turned to the super nanny for some family fine tuning. This is very embarrassing. nice to be here. Oh, first off, I just have to tell you how much of a fan I am. Thank you. So, like, you famous Wilson Phillips went on national TV yeah. to say, I'm not a perfect mama. That's yeah, a big deal. What I gave did. you the strength to do that. You know what? I wasn't looking at it like a celebrity or whatever going on TV. I was just, I'm a, I'm a normal mom. And I really just was so curious to see what she would say. You know, I wanted to I wanted to experience it and have her in my house. Was she intimidating going like that? Like what are you doing? Blah, yes. blah, blah, blah. Yes, she was. Yes. Yeah, she was a powerful presence, you know, from from the get go. And I, I was intrigued by her. You and know, you I have really four kids. I have four kids. I know you always wanted girls. Yeah, well I, it's not that I always wanted girls. You just assumed that it would happen. I just thought I would have girls because I, w I grew up with women, you know, all around me. And yeah. I just, men were like alien to me. <laughs> so, so basically when I had boys, I just said, oh, okay, I, I understand this now. Yeah. And I love it. I love it. Gosh, four boys. I don't mm -hmm. think I know what to do with one. Yeah. Like, I really feel like if I had a girl, I would know what to do. We'd go right. fear shopping exactly. and do our hair and makeup and practice our poses. Yeah. But I don't know what I would do you know, with it's, boys. I mean, I didn't either. But um, you just, you learn. You learn when you have the kids and it's easy. Boys are just easy going and yeah. you just put the overalls on or the jeans and you're done. You and know? how did it affect your relationship and, and you know, because you're single with your, not single, but you know, um, married with no kids at first and then you have kids. I have women come on all the time and say, oh my God, my sex life is different. The relationship is different. Is it? Um, yeah, I, I would say that it's a little different. I mean, they, they take precedence over your life. and. Um, it's all about the kids, you know, so your romantic side is, is a little uh, tweaked. But, um, <laughs> but you know what, I mean, we still, we make time for each other a yes. little bit. We don't have date nights like, like people tell us to do, but we're going to, you know, we're going to get there. Okay, well, yeah. it's time to see how Wendy and her family did on Super Nanny, and we'll start with the part that Wendy was most nervous about, the observation portion of the show, when the nanny comes to just look at you with your kids and see all the mistakes that you're doing. Mm. Check it out. The first thing that I see is the boys riding outside, and Mum desperately trying to get them inside, but they're just ignoring her. Hey, stop. Stop. You guys, don't stop. I felt extremely mortified. <laughs> Did you feel extra pressure? I would feel extra pressure if the super nanny was there for me to like really show that I am in control. Did you feel that? No, I was, I went into it open-minded and I just said, you know, I'm going to be who I am and I'm not going to be ashamed of anything because I know I'm a good person and I'm, I love my kids. So no, I wasn't trying to impress anybody, mm -hmm. honestly. I was just going to be who I was, and I wanted to see what she had to say. Okay, well, we have to take a break, but we'll be back with um, more Wendy Wilson and seeing these clips from Super Nanny of the things that you were doing wrong yeah. and how you were able to, um, to get it right. We'll be yeah. right back. Thanks. We're back honoring remarkable moms. 
still with me is Wendy Wilson, formerly of Wilson Phillips, who's dedicated her life to raising her four sons, a task that ain't easy at all. And also joining us is Wendy's mom, Marilyn. So when your daughter said that she was going to go on this show and like air all of her like laundry. Uh, I, I thought it was fantastic because she, um, she, she needed help. With four boys, four children, she needed all the help she could get. Are you the type of mom that is always telling her what to do? Like in, with the kids? I, I did the, at the beginning, and the first time I said that, I was put in my place. <laughs> During her time with the super nanny, Joe Frost, um, Joe observed Wendy's parenting skills, and she then put Wendy and her husband to the test by having them use her techniques to discipline their kids. Check it out. It's you. So remember, no conversation, okay? What's the first thing we say? Bedtime, darling. Bedtime, darling. Okay. So this is what's going on right now. They're in their beds and they're used to calling, calling, calling all the time and you going in. Wendy was strong and she simply led them straight back to bed. And even though they cried, within 20 minutes they were fast asleep. So tell me about the, that, that walking out of that room and hearing your babies cry for you and wanting you so badly. What yeah. was that like? It's like a knife in your heart really? when you hear that because you want to just go in there and grab them, you know, but you, you have to be strong. Yeah. What are some of the best tips that Joe the nanny taught you? The best tip she taught me was how to be consistent, mm -hmm. you know, because I'm not a consistent person. I'm, I'm a creative person who doesn't really have a schedule. I never have. Mm -hmm. So that being a mom is a challenge. It's a challenge for me to do that. But I try. I strive every day to do that. Mm -hmm. And um, so that and a, having a schedule put in place is really great for kids. So are you guys going to be getting back together anytime soon? Well, you mean Wilson Phillips? Yeah. Um, you know, we, we talk about it from time to time. We all have kids now, but definitely we're interested in doing something in the future, yeah. yeah. And my sister and I are doing some touring right now. Yeah, her dates. sister's Carney Wilson. You know Carney Wilson. Yeah. yeah. She's famous for losing all that weight and beautiful voice. Oh, yeah. my gosh. Yeah, no, the music is still in, in me and yeah. in us, so we definitely want to do it. Yeah. Okay. Now, Carney's a mama, too. Yeah. Yeah. So who had babies first? I did. You I, did? I was the guinea pig, yeah. Oh, so. you did? <laughs> yeah. But um, she, you know, we teach each other things about parenting. Uh -huh. We do. We do. Did you tell, because you were first when she had her children, were you like telling her what to do and getting on her nerves as a sister? I am not, le I'm not like that. You know, I'm not in your face like that. So if she asks me something for, adv for advice, yeah. I give it to her. You okay. know? Yeah. Well, you can catch Super Nanny Wednesdays at 9 p.m. Eastern and Pacific Time and 8 p.m. Central Time on ABC. Thank you so much, Wendy. Thank you, Tyra. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.